All right, YouTube, welcome back to another how-to video. This is how to fillet a large trophy bull red. Man, these things are known as one of the most difficult inshore fish to fillet, but I'm gonna show you some easy tips and tricks on how to get this done and get the most meat out of this fish. So nice and easy, first things first, I use a seven inch Dexter fillet knife. I use this uh, AccuSharp sharpener from Academy Sports and Outdoors. We're gonna make our first cut in the fish. It's very important that you cut with the scales, right? I start about an inch and a half behind this gill plate here. Slide all the way down till I feel that hard point on the middle of the fish. Now I cut down to this pectoral fin, spin the whole fish, and right where this discoloration is, it goes from white to that bronze, that's the start of its rib cage. So we're gonna work around that initially, and then at the end, we're gonna come back and get that belly meat. So once you've started your line there, you're gonna bring it down to this bottom anal fin, just like so. Okay, gonna spin the fish. Now, your initial cut, you're gonna curve that knife around and work all the way down this fin line, just like this. All right, now I use this thumb as leverage to pull the fillet up as I'm sliding that knife down. Just like so. Once you get here, you're gonna lift up with your thumb, press down on that first cut, and that's gonna break one of those main uh, rib bones there, and then you're gonna use this hand to pull as you fillet down the fish. So you're pulling, pull, all the way down to that tail. That's our first fillet right there. Next, same thing on this side. I'm right-handed, so I have a little bit of a different technique for step number two. Remember, we're cutting with the scales to the midpoint of the fish. Flip the fish. Bring that fillet knife all the way down. Now, instead of going down this uh, fin line like we did on the other side, I'm gonna come from the inside here, and that just works out better because I'm right-handed. And I just basically run that knife right here, starting at the bottom handle fin. I use that flex, that tapered flex, and I run across that line, that rib line in there, okay? And once you get up here, you're just basically cutting that meat away from the filet, or away from the uh, bones, just like so. Now, once you get to the middle portion of the fish, you're gonna stick your knife all the way through, angle it down, and slide to the bottom. Just making sure that you get the most out of that fish. Now you're gonna come and finish your filet. All right. Just like so. So we have our two filets looking nice and pretty right here. Now to finish things off, you don't wanna pass up that belly meat. That's the filet mignon of the fish. So I'm gonna insert the knife right here on the pectoral fin and we're gonna angle it to this point right up under the cheek. Now, you're, once you get to here, you're gonna feel a real hard bone that runs. And what I do is, I use all my weight to push straight down to break that bone. One, two, three. You can actually hear it. Then, where my initial inc incision was, take the knife and I run it down right about there. Just like so. I grab this big old hunk of uh, belly meat there and I just follow through with my cut and make a V right here. Follow through with that cut. Now here's what you're left with. You can clean this up, put this on the grill and after about five minutes, this little membrane will pull back. You can season all this good meat and eat out of there with a fork. And that's it guys. Got both fillets, both sides of the fish and the belly meat. And that's what we ended up with, just like that. Not bad at all. You cook these on the half shell or completely fillet them for a deep fry style cook. But that's it. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button for more fishing content. We'll see you on the next one. Ow!